friends, this is Mr. Mullet Gaming presenting a review show dedicated to the RPG video game genre. Some great news to report today as I've started a job with my favorite game store, Game Runners Ohio. Ironically enough, the game reviewing today, Final Fantasy V, focuses heavily on the job class system. Since I have to work today, I've put together a little review video. So prepare your WF4 forms and let's check it out. Oh, about two hours early. Final Fantasy V, developed and published by Squaresoft, now Square Enix, was released only in Japan for the Super Famicom in 1992 and directed by Hironobu Sakaguchi. The game has since been re-released in Japan and in the West on PlayStation, Game Boy Advance, iOS and Android, and on PC via Steam which is the version I played on. The game takes place in a medieval fantasy setting and centers on five characters, Bartz, Lena, Ferris, Galaf, and Kryal, whose main goal is to save the crystals that have mysteriously begun shattering. The one behind the phenomenon is the antagonist of the game, X-Death, which is part of a plan to release himself from imprisonment and gain the power of the Void. The protagonists become the Warriors of Light and turn their attentions to defeating X-Death and stopping the Void's energy from consuming all. The key feature of Final Fantasy V is the job system, which allows each of the characters to switch between one of 22 jobs and master the jobs to retain their abilities. Some examples of jobs include Knight, Black Mage, Blue Mage, Bard, and Summoner, to name a few. The game strategy revolves around mixing up combinations of jobs. For example, a Knight can use the abilities gained from a White Mage and use healing powers in battle along with the Knight's tremendous strength and ability to wield a sword. Final Fantasy V has several unique ideas, including the active time battle system, which allows for a continuous flow of actions in segmented wait times. This system was improved for Final Fantasy V, introducing players to a time gauge mechanic during battles, which indicates which character's turn is next. I'd be remiss if I did not spend some time discussing the job class system. Building and mastering abilities was tremendously fun, which I feel made grinding in this game enjoyable. The surprise of the abilities gained after mastering a job was very exciting. Difficulty-wise, I feel this was a more challenging game than other RPGs. This was partly due to the job system. Understanding key abilities gained by mastering jobs makes this game much easier. However, the game doesn't provide much indication, which can make it difficult to beat some dungeon bosses without trial and error. Playing through this game blind, I did experience some areas where I was just devastated by bosses. It wasn't because I was underleveled, but because I didn't have the right abilities equipped. This further emphasizes the experience level is secondary to the mastery of job classes. Once understanding the handful of abilities which are effective, the game's difficulty is greatly reduced. Overall, I'd rate the difficulty a 6 out of 10. This culminates with the game's final boss, Neo X Death, who can be extremely challenging if not prepared appropriately for this battle. This is a long game with an intricate main story and many side quests. I put in a little over 40 hours, but feel that I did not even scratch the surface of what this game offers. 
Overall, this is a great game and I recommend for any fans of RPGs. I am eager to replay this title in the future. The job class system can be confusing and overwhelming. The overall story isn't compelling, but there is a shocking scene which surprised me. Based off that, I give this game an A-. Sadly, friends, the first day of my job was not successful. After the accidental destruction of merchandise and my overall awkwardness around customers, I was let go. In contrary to my inability to master a job, Final Fantasy V's job mastery system is successful and makes this a unique RPG. Overshadowed by other titles in the series, Final Fantasy V is worth playing today. Well, that will do it for this episode. If you played this game before, please let me know about your experience in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Keep grinding. Fresh milk, fresh milk, fresh milk, fresh milk.